Hi, welcome to Alliance Communications. Did you just get a new email account and now you need it added to your device? Or maybe you just upgraded your phone and you need your email set up again. This tutorial is going to help guide you step by step. Before you start, there are a few things you will need to know. You will need to have access to your Alliance email address and password. If you don't know it, please call us during business hours and we can provide that to you. Every phone, device, and software version might look a little bit different. However, each step will be very similar. Today we are going to go through the steps to add an existing email address to your Android device. From your home screen, click on Settings. Scroll down, choose Cloud and Accounts. On the right hand side, press Accounts, Add Account, then Email. On this screen, you will enter in your email address and password. As you enter in the password, it will show as dots to mask the information for security. You can click on Show Password listed below to verify the information is entered in correctly. Once verified, in the lower left corner, press Manual Setup. This will allow you to customize server settings to match Alliance email requirements. Choose POP3 Account Type. On the server settings screen, you will see your email address, username, and password that will populate from the previous screen. Under Incoming Mail Server, you will verify the POP3 server shows pop.alliancecom.net. Security type should be none and port should be 110. If these don't display correctly, you can update them on this screen. Next, under Outgoing Server, Verify the SMTP server shows smtp.alliancecom.net. Press in the drop-down menu under Security Type and choose SSL Accept All Certificates. Choose Accept, then verify the port displays as 465. If not, change it. Make sure all information is displaying correctly, then press Next in the lower right corner. This will once again verify all information just entered. Next, it will verify sync schedule. Click next in the lower right corner. You have the option to change your account name and your name for outgoing email in this section. This is optional and up to you what you want displayed. Once you've updated the information, press done. Your email is now set up. Go back to your home screen and open your mail app. You will see incoming emails loading into your inbox. Send a test email to make sure it's working. It's quite a few steps, but you should be able to enjoy sending and receiving emails once you add your account. If you have any troubles or questions, call us and we'll be happy to help you out. Thanks for spending time with us today.